Good morning, everyone. I hope you're having a great start to your day. So this is week number 10. And this week, we are going to be talking about body composition. So let's go ahead and I will share my screen. We can go over what's to be expected for the week. All right, here we go. Okay, so body composition, <clears throat> you're going to go through an overview as we do week to week. Um, hopefully the midterm, sorry, I'm backtracking a little bit here. Hopefully the midterm was good for you. Um, I will be reading those and grading them. So if you didn't see a score, don't worry. Um, because the system doesn't grade short answer essay types of things. <clears throat> and then I have to go through and hand do it so I can read them and grade and then go from there. So please don't panic if you don't see a grade. It's just I haven't graded it yet. So I'll be working on that this week. Um, so back to this week here. Okay, so body composition, the PowerPoint for body composition in the quiz. So make sure we complete all those by Sunday. We have a discussion on body image, society and body image. So this is going to be a page that you're going to contribute thoughts to. Um, the discussion this week is understanding body composition. So understanding the different components that make up um, our body. The first two things that we'll be working on this week are how society and what we see day to day um, kind of makes what we think of body image. So um, the types of posters, what we see on television kind of forms our opinion of what we should look like. Um, and a lot of the time it is unrealistic. Uh, so that's what these two things are going to be about. Um, then we're going to understand body composition, uh, which goes more into anatomy and um, our actual, like what we're made up of. And then fit principle submission, you're going to go into that. So let me take a look here and see. So. What you're gonna be doing is gonna create a workout using the FIT principle. So this is all the information from the overview, from the PowerPoint. So uh, take a look at those one more time if you're not quite sure how to plan these things. Okay, so you're gonna talk about what the FIT principle is, is the frequency of exercise, how intense the exercise is, the time. So how many repetitions, how many sets are you doing within, or how many repetitions are you doing within the sets? And then the mode of exercise. So what type are you doing? What are you using? What major muscle groups? Okay, so that's the FIT principle. And then here is an example of what this should look like or how the FIT formula is applied. And then there's a couple other um, examples there for you. So one is with the use of exercise equipment. And one is just a submission that used body weight only. So there's two different types you can do there as well. So this just gives you an example of what it should look like, okay? And then the rubric is there as well, so you know what to expect, okay? And then the next thing, so for next week, we're gonna be tracking a, our diet, so what we're eating using my Fitness Pal. So if you haven't used that before, there's an app. And then there's also a video on how to set up that account. So there's the app for it. Once you are working in this, so everything you put in the app will then be available on your computer. Or if you want to just sign up through your computer, you can do that as well. I think it's myfitnesspal.com. When you're on myfitnesspal.com, that's where you're going to be able to uh, get a PDF for the week that you submit your three-day uh, diet that you've had. So just make sure that... Um, I guess probably go to your computer and do that first, and then you can always download the app if you choose to. All right. Okay, so quite a bit to do this week. Hopefully uh, everything goes smoothly for you. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me and I will do my best to help. All right, have a good day and a wonderful week and we will see you next week.